Mike Murphy. I was United States Army from 1973 to 1976. David Fries, Air Force, Air Force Reserves, 1986 to 93. Paul Jacobs, United States Navy. Dan Swanson, Lieutenant Colonel, retired United States Army. Blaine Wilhire, Army National Guard. Dan Calkins, I enlisted in the United States Army in 1967. Mark Left, U.S. Army Reserves, 87 to 94. I think Veterans Day is very important to recognize. These are uh, the, the, the people, the men and women who have chosen uh, to uh, put themselves uh, in service to this country to protect the freedoms that we have. I don't think you'll find anything in this country that does not trace back to uh, our military and what they have done to provide all of this for us. And uh, we need to honor them and respect them. And what I do on Veterans Day is I look back and wonder if I've earned it because I got to come back. It's, uh, it's the least that we could do just to recognize um, so many people that have given so much and uh, so many people that have given the ultimate sacrifice uh, for, for this country. Those that are in combat, those that are in headquarters and support, everybody has a job to do. You need to honor our veterans because of that. They, they're, they're what keep us here and keep us safe. One percent of our population takes on and puts their, potentially puts their life at risk for the other 99 percent. No one joins the military expecting to die. We join the, Amer the military expecting to live and to continue the freedoms for our families back home. And uh, we honor those who, are, who die in combat at Memorial Day. We recognize those who served on Veterans Day.